guys, what is going on? Back with another video, and today, and I guess throughout the whole weekend, I'm gonna be doing something a little special. I'm actually headed down to Ocean City uh, for their car show up there, and it's uh, actually a huge cruising, so if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, and actually stay tuned for the whole weekend, because it should be getting pretty crazy. But again, it is raining outside, so who knows what's gonna happen. I'm really hoping the turnout's gonna be good. But before I head over there, I wanna show you a couple of things I added to my car. So I actually put on the Stolen Show front license plate bracket. And if you guys haven't watched my previous videos, that's because I got three tickets for my car. The plate was one of them. So I am gonna have that Stone Grove rocket on until I can get it dismissed, and then I'll take it off again. Uh, but I actually added one more thing I wanna show you guys, and it's in the back. So let me walk around my car and show you. I added this as well. So if you see me on the road, make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel. With that being said, I am gonna meet up with my friends before we head over to Ocean City. So I'll talk to you guys when we get there. I just made it over to our meeting up, my friend. If you guys are familiar with the channel, you guys would recognize this three valve Mustang from a review I did, uh, I think two videos ago. So if you guys haven't seen it, I'm gonna post a link at the end of this video so you guys can go check it out. But yeah, I've totally forgot uh, to install my radar detector before I leave. So I just put it up there. It is a Valentine one. But yeah, with that radar detector being said, I, since I met it with my friend, it's time to hit the road and go to Ocean City. We're actually gonna meet up with a, I think a whole bunch of other people at this cruising ride out like event that's happening. So uh, once I get to that ride out event, I'll talk to you guys there. Just made it over to the pre-meet before we actually go on the cruise to Ocean City. Uh, it is raining pretty hard outside, so I'm not going to actually go out there and show you guys the cars, but we do have a couple cool things, and I am going to show you guys a ton of car content once we get down to Ocean City. Honestly, the drive has sucked so far. It is raining pretty hard outside, so everyone's going super slow, and the traffic is really slow as well. But hopefully it clears up when we get down there and we can have a good time. All right, guys, so we just made it over to the Chesapeake Bay Bridge. This is honestly my favorite part of the drive. Uh, I'm going to try to get some rollers for the bridge for you, and I'm going to cut to those clips right now. So there's actually some pretty nice cars right in front of me. There's this nice uh, Cobra and there's this classic Fed. I'm not sure what year this Fed is, but it is pretty nice. Hopefully you like those little roller clips. Honestly, I think the view from this bridge is absolutely fantastic. I'm not sure how well you guys can see that through this GoPro, but it's honestly an amazing view and it's one of my most favorite parts about this drive. About three fourths into the trip, we just made it over to the gas station. We got my friend's Mustang over here, mine, and then a couple random Mustangs, but nonetheless, this gas station's still pretty lit, especially because, you know, it's a rainy day. Didn't expect this much of a turnout, but hopefully there's a lot of cars to see tonight. I'm hoping we can actually make it out to a car show tonight, but I'll talk to you guys when we get there. Finally made it to Ocean City, guys. Finally made it. This weather on the East Coast is totally crazy because just a second ago it was pouring down rain and now it's like it wasn't even there. So hopefully it can stay like this for the rest of the night so we can have some fun, but I guess we'll have to see. Another sign that you're in Ocean City Cruising Week is when you see an undercover cop that pulled over a Mustang. And my radio techs are just going crazy for the amount of cops around here. It's showing about at least three others in the area. So definitely not the time to get a ticket. Hopefully I don't get three more like I did the other day. Fingers crossed, but I guess time will tell. So I just made it to my hotel and holy crap, the roads are totally awful. They are flooding everywhere and it's impossible for me to drive my car over 10 miles an hour because the water just flies up and just covers the windshield, especially when every car is drive past me as well. I definitely want to get some video of that, but I'm not going to do that when I'm driving because it's 100% dangerous, but hopefully I can get some footage of these roads later on for you guys. Yeah, it's just totally crazy. Just finished putting our stuff up in the hotel room and we came out because we're actually going to get some things for the hotel but as you guys can see outside actually did clear up so this looks fantastic and hopefully it stays like this until later tonight where we can actually go out and you know do some car spotting.
So just made it over to where we're about to have dinner, uh, coming over here and stopped off to take some photos and apparently my friend got pulled over on the way out of there. Have no idea why, but I'm about to find out. So just got out the restaurant with my friend. Apparently he actually got the ticket for crossing over the line to avoid a pothole and the police officer saw that he crossed over the line and then pulled him over and gave him a ticket. And luckily it wasn't an actual ticket, it was just a warning. So hopefully we don't run into any more problems for the rest of the trip, but let's keep our fingers crossed for that one. That right there is why I don't play around in Ocean City. Those people just got pulled over. So before we stop off at the movie theater, I actually stopped by one of the most, probably the most lit gas station in the whole United States right now. So right now I'm at the Wawa Ocean City. And if you guys know about Cruising Week, this is probably one of the most split spots. So I have the 2018 there and I'm going to walk around and show you some of my favorite cars. So one thing I think that's really cool, I don't know if you guys can see or not in this lighting is, but this is a GTO. But what I really like about this car is it has the European bumper on it. So it's actually a Holden bumper and it actually has the Holden emblem on there. Just saying that's really cool. Like I said before, one of my most favorite things about this meet is the diversity that they have over here. So right now I'm looking at a Hellcat next to a Vet, next to this uh, modified Eclipse. And I have the best thing about one of these meets is you don't know how much horsepower these cars have and what they have underneath the car. And a lot of these cars are fully built. So it's honestly a lot of fun to see them run. So at this meet, they added new tow zones. And if you park your car on the curb, you actually get towed. And one of the things I think is really funny is they actually have a tow truck just waiting for someone to park and illegally park their car so they can tow it away. I just think that's absolutely hilarious. Love the sound of those cans. Just saw this thing leaving. This is what you call some 4 by 4 action right there. Alright guys, that is going to wrap up the car show section, so I'll talk to you guys when I get to the movie theater. I'm not sure how well you guys can see me out here, however, uh, just wrapped up at the movie theater, it, and that's going to be a wrap for this video for day one. Stay tuned for day two, because it should be bigger and better things tomorrow, and hopefully the weather is better as well. And with that being said, I'll talk to you guys next video.